As Donald Trump seeks the presidency a third time, there's a vocal contingent of officials who served in his first administration who are offering warnings about his return to power and some dire predictions for the country if he's elected to the presidency again. His former defense secretary, Mark Esper, has called Donald Trump a threat to democracy. His former national security advisor, John Bolton, has called him unfit for the presidency. And his former running mate, Vice President Mike Pence, has said he will not endorse him. He said he, in good conscience he could not endorse Donald Trump. Now, this group of folks who have uh, issued these dire warnings about Donald Trump are outnumbered by the people who served in the administration who are backing Trump again. But it is very unusual to have vocal detractors like this speaking out against their former boss. We have not seen this in the modern presidency. And there are about a dozen of these people ranking from cabinet level down to lower communications aides. There are some former officials like former Attorney General Bill Barr who have been critical of Donald Trump, but who have left the door open to voting for him again. Barr has called Donald Trump a consummate narcissist, uh, but he said he's still not sure how he's going to vote in November. We have never seen this many people speaking out and speaking out so harshly, questioning the fundamental character and the threats to the country of the person that they used to work for.